All right, drivers behind the lines. Three, two, one, go! And here we go, jumping into mat qualification match number three. Right away, the Red Alliance has scored one, two, three game pieces only. Two, I think, are good. The Blue Alliance answers back with three in kind. Again, we're going to see these teams fighting over these pieces in the mid. Right away, it looks like Green Hope Falcons and eSpots have both claimed an additional game piece. One scored for Red, one scored for Blue. Both alliances get their Auton balance. As we enter Teleop, the Blue Alliance has a 11 point lead. We'll see if they can keep it as the match continues. Bots start driving around under the control of the human drivers. Right away, Red Alliance, Blue Alliance, looks like red, the Terabytes, they score a cube as the Red Alliance answers back. Geode bots are doing an excellent job of pushing game pieces around on the ground. East bots pick up a cube for the Blue Alliance. They're gonna score it in the mid row. The Blue Alliance has nearly scored all the cubes they can. We're gonna expect to see them start going for more cones. 69, 68.94 scores a cone for the Red Alliance. Neither team has yet completed a link, but that'll be coming very soon. As East bots pick up a cone, they line it up on the Row to score a link for the Blue Alliance. The Blue Alliance jumps forward to a strong lead, but we'll see if they can keep it. Looks like Optimus Prime is having a little bit of trouble in the midfield. Hopefully they can get back to help their Blue Alliance before this match comes to a close. Eastbot score another cone in the mid row as 68-94 scores a cube up in the top row. There's a brief respite as teams go back to their charge stations to find game pieces. Looks like 5190, the Green Hope Falcons, they've already got a cone at the ready. They're gonna try and score it up. There we go, for a quick four points. Almost completing another link. Ice Java, their Red Alliance partners are here for yet another cone. The Blue Alliance drops a cube down in the bottom row. These cubes in the bottom row can be big. They still can earn those link bonuses as the Red Alliance finishes a top row link for a 10 point swing. They jump, only five points keep Red from the lead. The Blue Alliance is answering back as eSpot score a cone, finishing another link for the Blue Alliance. The Blue Alliance already has four links. The Red Alliance has three links. If they can finish these up, it'll earn additional ranking points for the match. Green Hope Falcons, they score a cube in that middle section. That means the cooperation bonus is in effect. The Blue Alliance has already earned all the four links they need for an additional ranking point. They still want to win this match though, and with only a 13 point lead, it's not done yet. Cheers for the Red Alliance echo out as they try to answer back. Looks like they're gonna finish the last link in that bottom row. They get a clean double balance. That's gonna be big for their score. The Blue Alliance, they need to answer this balance back. With six seconds left, they need to be careful. Eastpots pop their way on up. There we go, Terabytes follow right on up. One second left. Oh, not quite. With a score of 110 to 99, both teams earning an additional ranking point. Blue for getting four links, red for their, for their charge station performance.